So in previous section, we saw how to do basic rotoscopy in Fusion. And now we will see how to do tracking in Fusion. So first of all, we will quickly see how we do two-point tracking in the After Effects. And then we'll do the same thing in Fusion. Let me import my footage. This is water tank. Import it here. This is set to 30 FPS. I need to change this to uh, 25 FPS. So go to interpret footage. Right click on it, interpret footage, main, and change this to 25. Now bring it here in the composition window. If you play it, you'll find this is shot by a handheld camera. Now let's bring uh, another footage, which is a uh, flag footage. And uh, this is alpha, so pre multiplied it. OK. Again, I need to change it to 25 FPS. OK. Bring it here. So this is the flag footage. I have made it in 3ds Max. And uh, I have to place it here on the top of this water tank. So first, we need to track this water tank footage. Uh, make it off for a while. Select the water tank footage. And here we have tracker. If you don't find it, go to window. And here you can find tracker. OK, fine. Now click on motion source tab and choose water tank footage as a motion source footage. Now click on track motion. The first track point comes in the scene. Since this footage has some rotation, so we have to take the rotation value also. Now we have two track points. This is track point one and this is track point two. So pick uh, track point one and uh, put it here on the left corner of the water tank. And now put this track point two on the right corner of the water tank. That's fine. And now let's analyze, click on it, and let's see. I think these are uh, going quite well. Stop it, and you can check frame by frame. OK, these are going quite well. Now go to Layer, New, and bring a null object here. Click on Edit Target and apply the motion to the null one. OK. And click on Apply. Apply dimension x and y. OK. Now you can clearly see that the null is going with the footage. Fine. Now let's enable the flag footage. Pick its whip and connect it to the null one. In this way, we can make flag at the child of null one. Now pick the pan behind tool. And this is the anchor point of the flag layer. You can see here. And I just need to put it here beneath the flag pole. Now, if you scale it, And now you can uh, put it here on the top of the uh, water tank. Now if you play the scene, you'll find the flag is completely going with the footage. There's no problem. Now let's do the same thing in Fusion. First, we have to bring the water tank footage here, open it. Now this is the footage. This is up to 1,000 frames. So I just keep it limited to 147. Press Enter. And here I keep it limited to 75 frames till this point. Now I have to do the same thing what I did in After Effects. I have to track the footage first. So go to Tools, Tracking, and apply a tracker tool onto water tank footage.